today what I'd like to do is bring back a really old game that was played years and years and years ago so it really really is very very old and it's called snail hop so I'm going to show you a picture and explain the game that's coming up next and then after that, we're going to see how some of the children, oh, I think they're still playing it out there, how they found this game. And we're going to have a look at them playing it as well. This is like hopscotch, but it is much more difficult. And what you need to do is draw a coil on the ground, like the one in this diagram, with as many sections as you like, as long as they're big enough for you or your friends to stand in. Players take it in turns to hop on one foot to the centre where they can then rest on two feet. There's no stone throwing like in hopscotch and you're not allowed to stand on any of the lines. If you do, then you are out. And once you've got to the middle successfully, you then have to hop all the way back to the beginning without standing on any of the lines. If you manage to do this, you are then allowed to draw your initials in any one of the squares. This becomes a place where the owner can rest with both feet on the ground, but all the other players must hop over it. So they're not allowed to hop in that square. So I hope you've got a very large hopping stretch. Play goes on getting more and more difficult as more squares get captured and initialed by the players. When the snail becomes unhoppable or completely marked, the player with the most initialed squares becomes the winner. If you are enjoying these videos and you would like to see more, why not subscribe now? There we go. If she stands on a line, she could be out. tiring isn't it? <laughs> Out! Oh yeah better with no shoes on. So when you get to the middle you can have a rest. So that's your aim to so get there without standing on any lines. Ooh. Go, go, go. Then you can have your rest. Keep watching her. If she stands on the line, she's out. Yes. Fantastic. Well done. Okay, she's got to come back out there. You've got to let her come back out. If she comes back out, she can then initial one of the squares. No, you can change feet if you want. Hmm. Yep. not easy is it but you're not standing on a line so you're okay but you can't really have a rest so you can make your snail as tiny or as big as you want it's quite a big one this one you could take some squares out if it's too hard <laughs> yay you get to initial one of the squares that's yours now your you own it so that means nobody else can um hop in your square they've got to hop over it whichever one you chose yeah they'll get tired there you go, nobody else can earn that square now. Sandra, it's time to party with Sandra. Come on, party, it's a beautiful time. So happy to find everybody smiling with me. Oh, Sandra, it's time.